My trail vision for the area is to provide a connection for communities. And that is one of the BLM's goals, uh, is to connect to communities. And so all of the communities that we have public land touching, we want to provide a trail experience. I think more trails close to home means that more people spend time on trails. You know, they're not putting their bike on a, on a vehicle to go to a trailhead. They're just riding from their house. So it changes the experience completely to have them close to home. Mountain biking in this community has been around for a long time. It was here before I showed up. Um, so the journey to, to build beyond what was already here started about seven years ago, and Imba was in the very beginning planning stages of it all. We, we had questioned whether we could build trails on the landscape east of Cedar City. You know, it's very rocky, very steep. That's where we brought Imba into the picture. We wanted some professional help to help us figure out if it was actually possible. So they've been part of the picture the whole time. Yeah, right along that back side, Mary. Just watch, the, watch hey. that app. Right here? My name is Bill Bergeron. Um, I am Red Rock's trail care specialist. I am a trail crew of one for Red Rock Bicycles. Might have uh, sort of came to this the way a lot of people do, build now and apologize later. Um, and then fast forward to now, applied and got hired to do this in January of 2021. I think what keeps me motivated is there's nothing like riding with your friends after you've having fixed something or you've built something and have people wahooing at the top of their lungs, noticing the difference of what you did. It's about all the drive you'd ever really need. And it's actually not that hard. I find most people I put a tool in their hand get pretty fired up about it pretty quick. It's actually pretty easy. Um, yeah, I almost dig more than I ride these days. Um, that's real. Some days it's just because I'm getting old and I'm tired at the end of the day. But other days it's just because digging's real fun. The impact the trail systems has had on our family is so positive. We actually purchased a house right by one of the main trails that the locals use, and it's literally less than a mile, then she can just launch and then just go with friends, and they all meet her there, and it's just a ton of fun. And it's something that positively infects the whole community, so it's good. So the Iron Hills trail system has impacted the team by making it easier to coach. But you could take a brand new rider on the Iron Hills trail system, and it'll be safe and fun and a learning experience. Uh, and then you can take an experienced rider and they don't get bored. It's the, the quality of trail and is just, it, it can't be beat. Uh, if I were to describe Cedar City to someone, I'd describe it as full of colors, opportunity. You can just go out your back door and explore anywhere. The cycling community here in Cedar City is like very diverse. You get anyone from like a little kid on a strider on the trails all the way up to your old person on an e-bike who's still enjoying the same thing you are. People should visit Cedar City for the trail system. Like Red Rock puts a huge amount of work into the trail systems to keep them fresh, running. You're always gonna meet friendly faces out on the trails. So if you don't have a community in your hometown, you can always make this your community.